everyone, we are from Bedok South Secondary School and we are here to share our crystal growing journey with you. Firstly, we thought to ourselves, what is a crystal? We did some research and found out that a crystal is a solid in which atoms, molecules and ions are regularly packed in an orderly repeating pattern in a 3D figure. We found this information cool and wanted to grow a crystal as well. We went to search up on the internet and decided to grow an ammonium dihydrogen phosphate crystal. So these are the materials needed and remember to wash all materials with deionized water to prevent impurities forming during the crystal growing process. So the first thing we needed to do is to obtain a seed crystal. We added 250 grams of ammonium dihydrogen phosphate which has a solubility of 118 grams per 100 millimeters of water at 80 degrees celsius and distilled water into a beaker. Next, we heated the mixture until all of the ammonium dihydrogen phosphate has been completely dissolved. Then, we stirred and allowed the solution to cool. After that, we transferred some of the solution into a clean petri dish to allow seed crystals to form. We let the solution rest overnight undisturbed and when we came back to check on it the next day, there were many small crystals that had been formed in the petri dish. So, we picked the most beautiful and most suitable seed crystal and tied it to a nylon string carefully. The remaining ammonium dihydrogen phosphate solution was then filtered into a clean, new 500mm beaker. We then attached the nylon string to an ice cream stick and immersed the seed crystal into the filtered solution. For the last part, we then had to wait a few weeks for the seed crystals to grow into a desired shape we wanted. Lastly, once the crystal had grown into the desired size we wanted, we took it out of the solution, dried it, and sealed it with a layer of clear nail polish. And this is the final crystal that we have obtained. Overall, we had a total of 2 attempts before we could achieve this final ammonium dihydrogen phosphate crystal. All in all, we found this competition a fun experience and had learned more about crystals. Thanks for watching.